Diddy is losing his mind behind those federal jail walls. Diddy is asking the judge for a gag order and says the grand jury witness making false claims. Now, if you guys don't know, someone came out and spoke the other day. The man that has all of Kim Porter's stuff from her diary, she has videos. And also, did y'all know that allegedly Kim Porter gave Cassie all of these videos and stuff of Diddy? She said, baby, I don't know if I'm gonna be here but I'm gonna give you the receipts so you can hand him his bootay, okay? Now, let's spin the block on the grand jury witness on the news when he left court, child, with his attorney. Your public statements you've mentioned, eight videos, eight celebrities, six mm -hmm. of them men and two of them women. Can right. you tell me where that's inaccurate? You're right. Out of those eight videos, eight celebrities, six men and two women, how many of those eight celebrities were close to being underage or potentially two, underage two males out of the eight celebrities um who were recorded having intimate relations with sean combs how many of them appeared to be either inebriated or intoxicated or into the influence all of, of them out of those eight how many uh, appear to be potentially victimized how many might have been victimizing oh were were victims, victims or were perpetrating? Victims. And of those eight, Especially. how many seemed to be potentially minors? Two to three, or possibly three. Two to three how minors. did you end up in possession of these flash drives? I ended up with a flash drive with a friend um, from a record label that I was, um, at the time I was recording in Atlanta. And I ran into a person that um, knew Kim Porter. So at the same time, she wanted to speak to her on the phone because she heard my voice. He said, who that? That's Courtney B. And then um, later on that night, he came over and gave me the flash drive. The only reason why I think Diddy is trying to put a gag order is because he doesn't want all this information so public. The fact that people are able to watch this all play out, he feels like everything needs to be silenced. And although I know some people are concerned about him getting a fair trial, there are a lot of people in New York that still don't really know that much about him especially upstate like so if they pulled people from upstate new york or like surrounding areas of new york like older people they don't know what's going on he can have a fair trial but also you were public a lot of people looked up to you a lot of kids looked up to you and what you did was disgraceful and i believe that there should be transparency with the public because of what you've done um i also heard Allegedly, Kim Porter gave Cassie a lot of videos and stuff, allegedly. So if something happened, Cassie had the receipts, child. Kim said, baby, I don't know if I'm going to be here, but if I'm not, here you go, love bug. And you know what I think is really funny? The fact that Diddy has the audacity to think that he is controlling stuff behind those walls. Like, sir, go sit down have a seat you ain't running nothing but your mouth and in pockets to your attorney because we ain't trying to hear it we don't care about what you have to say you're a villain you're a bad person and the public should know the public should know i don't feel like this should be disguised it should be hidden i think everybody should know what diddy is about because everybody had been speaking about these diddy parties and what was like allegedly going on and like, he's really trying to play the fool. Am I the only one that thinks this?